Hey guys, so I'll be unpacking this binder for you guys to let you see what I got in mine. This is a black croc print style binder. It comes with the inserts, as you can see from the side there. Okay, let's get it open. I've covered it over because my address was on here. And this looks like it's been opened already. You see how that looks, but we'll have a look. All right, so this is the binder. It's got a metallic snap closure. And you get one, two, three, four card slots, a slot on the side here for cash or important docs. The rings are quite big, I'm not sure the size, so that's good. Got these fish grips, two, four, six, seven of them I think. And you've got another side insert there all right guys i actually changed the way i was filming so you would see the first half of the clip was originally filmed in portrait but now i've swapped the camera to landscape because i feel like this video is going to be longer than a minute and i just want to talk through everything that i got so i want to go back over what i was saying so i removed the package which you saw so it's this croc style um wallet this is what it looks like the front and the back okay so this is the front that's the back like i said it does have a magnetic closure let's take this out magnetic closure which is quite quick all right and your rings are a good size so let's get these out i always struggle i'm pretty sure there's an easier way to take these off but i always struggle so i'm just gonna rip it out like this <laughs> okay let's get rid of those sorry this is all my little <laughs> cream on there so this came as a bundle so we're gonna unpack and see what we got. Alright. We got a little ruler. Or you could use it as a bookmark. Got some labels here, sticky labels that you could use to sort of, you know, put your categories on. Get some budget sheets so that's the front that's the back and you could easily laminate these to make them reusable save yourself some money there we've got some more labels again these are sticky ones just like these so get those and you get some of these as well okay and you have some of your categories here. So just the general ones that I guess they think that you're gonna be using. And I do see a couple here that I'll be using. So we'll do these together. All right. And then you've got these ones here as well. So you get two sheets with these. Not bad at all. And then you get one, two, three, four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve clear zipped pouches to go in so i'm going to set this up and then we are going to transfer our money okay guys i'm starting off with very minimal categories so i brought out my brother label machine and i'm going to create a label for kaylan for myself and also one for 
don't know if they've got a petrol one. Mm, I don't see anything for petrol. Okay, there's transportation, so that could go under petrol. And, oh, and there's dining out. I thought I would have had to make one, so that's good. Um, I'm just, just going to put what I need off these, and then the ones that I'm missing, I will just make on my machine here. So let me move this out of the way. So what I'm going to do for each one, I want to know which way I'm going to turn it. So I'm trying to figure out which way the envelopes open. So they open this way. So I'm thinking, because I'm right-handed. Let's go, let's see. I think I would want to open them like this. So I put the stickers here. So let me get about five of them and make sure. that I turn them the way I want them before I start so I'm not making any mistakes and um, just to answer a few questions that may pop up I will link where I got this from that will be named I don't know what that is that's got some sort of debris between there I'm not going to use that one I'll clean it out later but we ain't got time for that so I'm just opening these. They're a bit, you know, semi-deformed, but it's okay. It's gonna happen. You know, when you're ordering stuff, that's gonna that's more likely to happen. So these open. I'm trying to uh, okay. I'm gonna speed this up. All right, so I need about six. So I'm just gonna make sure I've got six. One, two, three, four, five, six, okay. So these ones, not gonna use them yet. I'm keeping everything pretty minimal, okay? I don't want to have 50 million envelopes and nothing's working. I'm restarting my journey. For those of you who have been with me since 2017, you guys know I used to do cash envelopes. And um, I'm sort of going back into that. So this would be the video you've seen after my first cash envelope video for June. So I've sort of invested in this because I really want to get back on top of things. It's just got a little tweezer and I'm going to get this side up. Oh, actually, this is Claire. It's actually translucent. I didn't realize. I thought it was white because of the backing. Let's just try to just do it by eye. All right. I didn't realize it was um, a clear one. So these do look a bit odd. Ugh. Be right back. Got me clear label. Let's see what they're gonna look like. So let's just swap the tapes out again. Right, let's take these off. Okay, it's still not as bold as this one, but it's fine. You get the gist. All right, let's get on with the rest. The other categories. So we've done ours. We've got one. We need to get one for groceries. 
groceries. They don't have groceries, do they? Okay, they do. Lord, my eyes, my eyes, my eyes. I feel like this doesn't look as dark. I don't know, maybe it's my eyes. It's fine guys, it's fine. Right, this says Kia, right? And this says personal. So I'm gonna use that and that and make one to make it personal Kia. This is a disaster. Personal care. Doesn't matter how it looks, if it's crooked or well. You can tell this this was created by an, an American because they say gas. We say petrol here, but it's okay. It's the same thing. Gas, petrol, fuel, all the same. All the same, darlings. I thought I counted out six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, darn it. Transportation, in it, And I put gas. Ugh. Okay, we don't want to waste a sticker, though. So, um, can we remove it and put it back? Where did it come off? I think it came off here. Can we remove it? And put it back on. Shall we see? Is it going to ruin it? Listen, babes. We're not going to stress ourselves about that, okay? We're just going to get a new one because that will get ruined. All right. This would be eating out. Okay, they don't have eating out. So they've got dining out, so dining out and eating out, the same thing. All right, don't worry if it's crooked, guys. We're not here for, you know, this is not a fashion show, <laughs> okay? Things are not gonna always be perfect. Um, yes, crooked stuff does bother me, but at the end of the day, that's not the purpose of this video. What I've done, I've taken my little envelopes from the safe. I've got a couple of them here. 
which you guys would have seen. These go into my penny bridge, my Filofax penny bridge. These go in here, but obviously I don't walk with cash. I'll explain. I don't think I need to explain it, but I will explain it further in a different video. So, um, this, I've just got a couple of them in here that I've sort of, you know, put little pockets for my extra cards and stuff that I'll be using. But for right now, these... As you can see, the cash is hanging out of one. We are going to basically put them into here. All right. So let's get our stuff lined up. So because these are not really uniformed, I'm going to put them at the back. And these will go after. So what I'll do, I'll put Wow, I've got to pop the holes out. Flipping heck. Alright, we got all the little holes out. So let's put well I thought I did. There's a cheeky one there. Okay, and then I'm gonna divide these up just with that little ruler. And then I'm going to figure out which ones I want at the front from here. So we're going to do groceries, dining out, personal care, guys. Okay. Now, I would usually put these in here, but I want to laminate these because I want to make sure that they're um, reusable. I don't like to be going out buying excessive amount of these things. If I could just laminate it, trim it down to the size, round the edges off and reuse it. Okay, so I'm not going to be using those for now. Um, there's no need to at the moment anyway. So these are our categories that we'll be stuffing. The only thing with these, with the zippers being on one side, it's a bit lumpy dumpy, but what can we do? I usually would remove the zippers, but um, we'll see, we'll see. I usually remove them, but we'll see. We'll, we'll work with these for now. All right, so let's get these stuffed, restuffed, okay? So we've got our petrol. Let me put these like this. Right, so for the week we budgeted 25. So we've got 20 and 5. We didn't have no five pound note, so we're using a placeholder. Groceries we set aside. I'm pretty sure this isn't a part of it. I think it's 25 or is it 50? Right, 50. So 20, 40, 50. Personal care. I had to handwrite this. So cute. Um, okay, let's get that out. And we set aside 30 for personal care. 20 and 10, 30. Dining out, which is my eating out little thing. 20, 40. Mm -hmm. 
Then we've got our little Kalan. And he's got 40 as well. Gracia, we've got no money for her because, yeah, we don't. I'm trying to see something if I. So, what I should have done was do it like this. Maybe one like that, one like that. Nah, it would still, it would still be bulky. It's fine. It's fine, guys. And I like how much space the rings have got between them so this is it guys so we've got gas groceries personal care dining out k -Line. and what i'm gonna do i am going to take my bank card so this this baby here and she is gonna live in this wallet, like so. Okay, she lives in here now. We do need to get a pen for our pen loop. Um, I don't have a fancy schmancy pen that could go in here yet. I'll find a pen, there's a pen somewhere. I just don't know where. Let me find it. All right, I've got a bunch of pens here that are a little fancy looking. I've got my hot point pen. I told you guys I used to like different appliances and I got a pen from hot point we've got Aperderm. they do skincare i've got these which would be perfect for when i'm actually filling these sheets out when they're laminated and then i've got my things i can't say out loud by yes studio and then i've got a john lewis pen so we're going to kind of see which one would work best so I feel like this is too fancy, right? So let's go with this. Mm, not sure if I like how that looks. <laughs> let's see the hot point. This is really heavy. Nah. Mm -mm. so guess what we're going with this pop of color simple we're going for this one okay let's move the card over a little so this card has been removed from my normal everyday wallet I will do an updated video and explain everything. I know right now it seems a bit secretive. It's not a secret. It's just not the right video to be talking about it because I already have plans to film a different video. So let's snap it together. I don't like how that looks bunched up there. Why is that? Is it because my pen is too big? Oops. It's got a highlighter. Let, let, girl. Girl okay we'll put the pen here <laughs> we got two pen loops baby we are blessed there we go much better it's a high-end looking thing and then i've got this basic ass pen but i'm scared that i lose this and then i'll get really ticked off so i'll stick to this one and it's got a highlighter so if i need to highlight anything it's there it's accessible and everything so this wallet is going to live at home that's where it's going to live and then this 20 pounds obviously i'm going to put it here because it needs to get redeposited as well all right but i don't want to put it all the way in until i forget it there so i want it to peep up a bit like so so we've got about 180 in this wallet here so that's it guys this video has been over 40 minutes i'm gonna try to completely edit it down 
um thumbs up the video if you really enjoyed it i know it was a bit like long-winded but you know we got there in the end i love it i love it it's quite good quality as well and i love the print and i love the fact that we've got these little bits here and these little bits and i could see myself getting a separate one of these just a separate one for days out when i know i'm gonna take cash so i think that might be a thing i'll get a different color one that i could take out with me like if i'm traveling or wherever i'm going i'll have this with me in my bag um yeah all right thanks so much for watching once again give the video a big thumbs up we really appreciate it and until next time ladies and gents i'll see you in the next video bye love and light